This video is brought to you by Monster Insights. Today, we're going to cover how to fix Facebook incorrect thumbnail issues in WordPress. This is something that you'll see when you're sharing an article to Facebook and you notice that the image is wrong or maybe even missing. There are a few different reasons why this might happen, but I'll also show you a few different ways to fix that. Hey everyone, I'm Christina with WP Beginner, where we teach you all about WordPress so you can grow your website and reach your audience. And one of the best ways to reach your audience is by sharing things on your social media sites like Facebook, but sometimes that can get a little messed up. So the first method we're going to do is by using a plugin called All-in-One SEO. To get started, we're heading over to our dashboard to install All-in-One SEO. And don't worry, if you already have the Yoast plugin and you don't want to switch to the All-in-One SEO, then I'll show you how you can fix the images using the Yoast plugin in just a second. So we're going to go to our dashboard, head over to plugins, add new, and up at the top, we're looking for all-in-one SEO. This is the one we want. So let's go ahead and install this. As always, you want to stick around and activate it as well. Great. Now you see it here. You can either go to SEO settings here, or you also have a tab up here on the left. If you ever need to come back to it, you can go to all-in-one SEO. And then we want to go to feature manager. And from here, you see a few of the features that are free that are add-ons that you want to install. We want to install the social meta. So we'll click activate. Great. Now that that's activated, we'll have an area in our posts that will allow us to properly display the images. So I'm going to create a new post. And then once you create a post, if you scroll all the way down, you see a tab called social settings, and this is where it will help you. You see the social settings, which is great. And then one of the areas that you can do is upload an image. So then you just want to upload your featured thumbnail that you want to make sure that is a part of this article when you share it and everything else looks good. So then you can publish it. Then once you share that in Facebook, then this image will be what comes over properly. Now, the second method is using Yoast SEO plugin, and it's very similar. It does a very similar item and I'll show you how that works. So I'm going to go to plugins and you don't ever want to have more than one SEO plugin. So just to showcase how to do this, I'm going to uninstall all in one and then we'll go add a new search for the Yoast SEO plugin and we'll install that. And if you want to see exactly how to set this all up, we actually have a video that you can watch on the step-by-step -step on how to install and set up Yoast SEO plugin. And now that that's installed, we can go to either settings here or we have SEO over here and you see the social is already set up here. So now again, we can go to our post that we were working on. We want to scroll all the way down after you've created the post that you're working on. And we have this social tab that you can click on from here. You can select the image again, either upload the image, or if you already have it in your media library, you can select that. And now that will be the image that gets sent out when you share it with Facebook. Now, if you need to troubleshoot a little bit, there's a couple of other things you can do. First, you can also clear your page cache in WordPress. So if you have caching turned on somewhere, just find your caching. A lot of times it'll be up here somewhere and you can clear your cache. You can also look at Facebook's debug tool. So I'll show you what this looks like. The Facebook debug tool, you can go to developers.facebook.com forward slash tools forward slash debug. And you can test out a crawler and see what Facebook has for it. So for instance, I'm going to grab the written version of this video and we can put it in there to debug. And then it will tell you what should be fixed and what's going on. But the biggest thing is to scroll down here and make sure that it looks right. So if it looks right here, then that means that it's good to go. And if you're not seeing this, just click scrape again and just know you might have to do this one or two more times. And then once you click scrape again, then your link should show properly and you should see the proper thumbnail for your site. Another way to check and make sure everything is looking good on your site is by using something like Monster Insights. Monster Insights connects your site with Google Analytics so you see exactly how your traffic is doing. You see your top performing pages. You see your top performing affiliate links if you're in affiliate marketing, your top refers, and so much more. Plus, the cool thing is Monster Insights brings all this data right into your WordPress dashboard so you can make data-driven decisions in real time. To get started, just head over to monsterinsights.com 
and make sure you use promo code WPB VIP to get the best discount on Monster Insights. And thanks for watching.